Okay, 7 a.m. practice done. Time to drive an hour and a half and go get a doctor's appointment done. So I need to get gas before I hit the highway because I'm driving about 120 miles today there and back and I am 140 miles till empty. And I wanna show you guys something about the gas stations here at Purdue. So gas at this gas station right on the corner of Northwest is 179. But if you drive a mile up the hill, the gas prices are just a little different. All right, so just up the hill at whatever this Family Express gas station is, 177. It's always one to three cents cheaper up the hill. So if you are ever at Purdue, don't go to the gas station on campus, go to the one just up the hill because it'll save you a little bit of money. Waiting for gas is always the most boring thing because I can't listen to my music because my car's off. Okay, so now that I have acquired gasoline, it's time to acquire gasoline for my body, AKA coffee, AKA I'm kinda tired, I didn't get much sleep. That was my own fault, I went to bed late and had to wake up very early. And I knew I was gonna wake up early, but this is my excuse to get a venti coffee and I probably would've gotten one anyway because it's hard for me to just stay awake while driving and that's normal, the, 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 the drive on the highways in Indiana is like hypnotizing, not in a good way, more like in a way there's so much empty fields in the winter and there's so much corn in the summer that it's just constantly passing and you feel like you're on an endless road. So I need coffee very badly. After an hour and a half car ride and a venti coffee which is now empty, I've made it to my destination. So I spent an hour and a half driving here, got here about a half hour early, just so I could fill out the paperwork and do all that fun stuff. I like to be early, but I was a half hour early, and I got in a half hour late. So I drove an hour and a half, waited an hour for a 10 minute appointment. Now I'm gonna get lunch and drive an hour and a half back. It's like four and a half hours for 10 to 20 minutes of what I was actually needing to do. <sighs> well, at least I can get some McAllister's. And that right there is what we call trash parking. All right guys, I am about to go on an adventure. I don't know where I'm going, I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm gonna get in my car, drive, and wherever I stop, I'm gonna stop. I'm only taking this camera you're watching me on right now and this camera hoping to film stuff, hoping to take pictures, don't know where I'm going, don't really know what I'm gonna shoot, what I'm gonna film. I'm just gonna get in my car, go, and see what inspires me. Okay, so I know it wasn't like a terribly long adventure, but it was an adventure nonetheless. A lot of slow-mo clips from that. Hope you enjoyed it. I don't think I got any good photos. I was too focused on filming myself taking photos instead of worrying about actually taking photos. But it's all for the vlog, all for the vlog. Also, the main reason I stopped taking photos for the day is because I'm very hungry. It's only 4.44, 4.44 p.m., what a great time to be vlogging. But I really want dinner, I'm really hungry for some reason. My eating schedule is so bad, guys. That is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new, be sure to hit subscribe because I'm here every single day doing different videos and stuff for you guys. Thanks for watching, see you tomorrow.